Right, hello folks, welcome to tonight's live stream. This is Sim City. It's all been a bit messed up today with the schedule. I do apologise about that. I'm in the process of moving house, which means, yeah, everything's a little bit haywire. Um, we've actually moved into the new house, but I've had to come back to the old house uh, to do the stream because there's no internet yet at the new house. So like I say, completely messed up, which is why I'm now two hours late starting the stream. I do apologise for that. Uh, since it is a little bit late, I'll probably only be going for a couple of hours tonight. But I thought we'd do an hour of that on SimCity and then an hour, uh, an hour with Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, anyway, let's get started because we do not have time to waste. So we recently started this second city, Amchitka Mesa, uh, in the previous live stream, which we are using for our Omega City. And despite the fact we've only got a small population at the moment, uh, we also have a fair amount of money coming in. And we've already started building our first mega tower, which, yeah, I thought was pretty important uh, because if we start putting tech levels on, then maybe our Amiga will be able to uh, boost some profits for us. Uh, with that said, we've still got quite a bit of work to do here, and it's telling us about the great works, which I really don't care about right now. So let's just go back to the city view. <coughs> and I've got to try and get my bearings. Uh, right, I was worried last time because the game crashed, wasn't I? Uh, just as I was closing down the stream. But fortunately, it looks like we haven't lost any progress. Right, now, before we actually start doing any exciting things today, I'm just going to go ahead and check how we are with our ore and our oil. Oil looks good. Ore, on the other hand, doesn't look so good. We're at full capacity. Can we add storage onto here? No, we can only add storage into our trade area, which we are currently just using for oil. So I guess we could, uh, that's because we're buying it off the global market, aren't we? I guess we could stick some stuff on there for ore. Although in saying that, we're producing quite a lot of Omega, it's got to be said at the minute. But yeah, I'm going to stick a coal thingy-majig onto here. Let's speed things up a bit so we can actually start making some money. Um, right, what is it we need to tack on in order to store some ore? Crude oil, we've already got one. Freight, no thank you. Coal, raw ore, that's the one. That's the one we need. So we'll plonk that down there. Does this have delivery trucks? Yes, it does, but we're maxed out. But I just need to check that we're only collecting the ore in on a local basis. So if we go into ore, we'll just click use locally. The selected resource will be kept for your own use. That's what we need. Now that means that we're going to run out here, which is no problem. We can start storing it here. So we can store 20 tons of the stuff in the mine. And we can store... Only 20 tonnes here as well. I'm quite surprised by that. Thought we'd be able to hold a little bit more than we could, but it'll do. We've still got 22 months worth of ore underneath our feet. Which should last us well, quite a while, I should think. Hopefully to the point where we are getting bored of this city. Maybe a little bit longer, who knows. I like this effect, this purple smoke. Looks very, uh, well, it looks like something you'd expect out of a superhero film, really, doesn't it? You go in there, you get a spider bite or something, I don't know. Uh, right, so, demand, demand, demand. We've got a lot of residential demand. But I'm not too keen on the residential demand. I suppose I could put a medium wealth here. Uh, what's this? Amiga Co. Progress. I don't, in all honesty, actually know what that means. What I do know is that we're not making any money. It's probably because we've only got an apartment level in place. So I'm just checking my text messages. Um, I'm not sure why it says Amiga Code Progress there. I wonder what happens when that fills up. Interesting. I guess, I guess we could stick some more residential in here, but... Not something I really want to do at the moment. Um, 
we might have to though if we're going to put some more tech in. I know the actual, I've just noticed the city itself hasn't exactly been futurised, has it to uh, the level that our other city has. Maybe we could stick some futurised stuff in. I mean it doesn't really make too much difference in all honesty. But you know, it is supposed to be cities of tomorrow so I guess we should do so. The Excitatorium's only 400 simoleons. And if people aren't building there, we can plonk it in. Whoa, we just deleted a factory. Oh, well. I mean, they don't care about it, but it should hopefully futurise them anyway. So we can stick a couple around. Put some in, as they say. Yeah, look, people like that. We don't really need to futurise the Mega Tower, but they can have one anyway. Can we futurise these things? I don't know, to be honest. I'd have thought we'd have been able to, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. Hmm. Our trade depot is completely and utterly full to the brink. I don't mind, in all honesty, it being full. Because it just means that we're not going to run out of supply here to the Amiga Co. factory. Uh, what do we actually need to do in order to expand that? We're going to have a look at that in just a minute. The Amiga Co. progress hasn't exactly uh, increased to that particular bar. So... We've got some light commercial needed, which I'm not concerned about, but a heck of a lot of everything else. I do really want to use this for tech, but I guess we could stick another mega tower in later for, for tech or whatnot, couldn't we? Let's go for a standard uh, medium wealth apartment level. And what I do need to think about doing is building a university somewhere, but I'm guessing a university here isn't going to be the best course of action in our Amiga town. Which means we can save that for our uh, new city, which we haven't yet built. Or maybe find a way of sticking it over yonder. We'll figure that out. What was that noise? Some dirty, disgusting factory, no doubt. Uh, right, city specialisation. Who's complaining? Amiga demand is high, but current production rates cannot meet industry's needs. That's interesting. So despite the fact we've only got a few factories around... We're actually not producing enough Amiga to please everybody. Additional factories, obviously, or Amiga production lines will increase production rates. Let's see what we can tack on to this thing, if anything. Well, we could put some production lines on. Should we stick one on here? Look, oh, I can put them anywhere. They haven't actually got to be nearby, but I guess we could keep it nearby for the time being, couldn't we? Because we just know where everything is then. I'm not totally sure what that has done. Well, I think it's bumped up the amount of crates of Amiga that we can produce. I don't think it was on 4,800 uh, moments ago, was it? I could be wrong on that. But I'm um, kind of guessing we sort of want the material storage to go down. Because that means that we're hoarding it if we're producing too much, doesn't it? Or producing not enough. So we'll stick another production line on. It's always fun. Look, our profits have gone up even more now. 6,000 simoleons per hour. And we've only actually got 10k sims. I'm liking this Amiga, I've got to say. Uh, right, what do we need to do to build some of this other good stuff? Drone assembly line. Amiga headquarters in the region. Okay, we need to look at that. Uh, let's close that. Amiga factory, Amiga headquarters. We need to have total franchise profits of 5,000 simoleons per hour. And we're just shy of 4k at the moment. Right. I've got you. So we need to start making more money, basically. Um, how are we on ore? Mm, I guess we might want to think about sticking another ore shaft down. The only problem is the fact that there's not a lot of it here. 140 tons under there. It's a bloody shame we can't stick it down here actually, isn't it? Maybe if we delete some of this road, I mean... Do we really need that road? Let's try, shall we? Wow, look at our money now, 7,600, I'm loving it. I'm loving it, I'm loving it, right. Ooh, abandoned buildings. Don't like the sound of that. 
May as well delete this as well because it's not doing anything at all. To be honest, is it? Right, where's that abandoned building? Cause building fire sod off then. And we need to. I guess maybe upgrading the road might help. I don't know. Right then, uh, I was going to add another ore shaft in. And yet yeah, we can plonk it down there. Now 340 tons, that's more like it. Uh, that's more like it. And we can now mine 45 tons per day. And what that means is this should stay at capacity more. So hopefully the deli delivery trucks will never run out of ore to be delivering. Which in turn means the Amiga Co factory should not run out of good stuff. And it needs power. That's not good. Our profit has gone right up there. Uh, did we put a coal in? I can't remember. How are we? We've got a mi minus 17 megawatt deficit. Well, that's clearly too much. So we're going to say goodnight Vienna to our wind power plants at this point, I think. No, we're not. We need money. 9,500. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. And it's closed at the moment as well, and we're still making 9,500. I guess they're running on the Amiga. They've already created. Oh, there we go. Look, producing Amiga once again. I'm still going to get rid of that power plant, though. Because this is starting to struggle. Fair enough. Uh, can I just see? Where's the headquarters? Uh, it's where the factory is, is it? I think. Yeah, maybe. Right, we can do it now as well. Awesome. That means we can get all the other upgrades available. And really start raking in the cash. But before we do that, let's see how much money we're going to need for power. Ah, water as well. Interesting. There's hardly any water here either. Um... Right, a coal power plant is 17,000. We could go for an oil power plant. Although we've only got... Is it crude oil? Or does it have to be refined or something? Hmm. Maybe we could just use the crude oil. So I'm thinking if we use our own crude oil, that will save us some dosh in the long run. It is, of course, twice the price, both in expenses per hour and in initial purchase costs. But I'm going to risk it. I think we can. Uh, demolish. Say goodbye to our wind power plants. And hello to real power. And yet yeah, we're going for oil. Let's just put it somewhere where we can add upgrades later. That seems a good, as play a, good a place as any, I would say. And pause. Mm, 100 megawatt excess. It's a little bit excessive, but... Uh, yeah, we will be able to sell our power to neighbours later. Local delivery of crude oil switched on. Global delivery of crude oil switched off. That's fine, especially at those prices. I do not want to be paying that when we are collecting this ourselves. The only issue I'm thinking of is will it interfere with our flow of Omega... I'm kind of hoping not. Now, our profits have uh, lifted. Well, they've actually gone down. And I'm kind of thinking that's something to do with the lack of power situation. And we're also having a lack of water situation now that we're going to have to contend with. Uh, hello to everyone who's just joined me on the live stream, by the way. Uh, sorry I haven't been looking over at my laptop screen, seeing who's there. But uh, feel free to post a comment if you want to ask me anything. We're playing SimCity Cities of Tomorrow at the moment. And then a little bit later we'll be playing Final Fantasy VIII. Right, water. Where's the water table? Right, we've got a little bit of water around, but not a whole lot. We've got a minus 6.7 deficit. How much water is there? 1,000 kgal. It's not going to last us a whole lot of time, that is it. And I, have an, I haven't actually got a whole lot of water in the other city that we've got running either. So, yeah, that could cause some issues. I'm thinking if we stick down the sewage treatment plant. The futurised one that both creates water and gets rid of sewage. Where's it all going at the minute? Oh, it's all going to our other city. Okay, okay. What I'm going to do, just to help with the water problem, 
is nip on over to region view stop buying sewage head on back over to city view and now we've got a deficit fair enough but nothing that this can't take care of I should hope uh, I'm thinking it puts clean water down, doesn't it? I mean, all the poo's going to be going there, so you're not going to want it near your residential area. Let me just see what it says. Mm, don't worry about ground uh, pollution. Well, I won't. Where should we put it? There? Somewhere where we can expand, of course. That looks good. If we get this thing opened up, Ah, oh, we need control net. We should be getting that, shouldn't we, from uh, our other city, maybe? Maybe we can buy it. Uh, control net. Yeah. White, Sings, White Sand Springs does not have any control net to sell. Well, can we stick in a control net generator thing without having to put in a whole bloody academy? Because I do not want to have to put a whole academy in. Control net facility, yes we can, actually. Although we do need a nasty 40,000 simoleons, although we're not too far off. So if we put that in, that should help with the sewage sanitizer, which in turn should give us clean water. Whether it'll be a lot of clean water, I don't know, but... It's got to be better than nothing, seeing as how there's hardly any water here in this uh, city. Or in the region, to be honest. Whoa, I'm confused. How did we go from 36,000 to 26,000 when... Oh, did I misread it? I must have misread it. Oh, well. Let's just wait for this. Come on, 40,000, please. How are we doing here? Running out of raw ore. Is that because... Our uh, pesky... Oh no, that would be oil, wouldn't it? We didn't put coal in, we put oil in. Uh, raw ore. Right, okay, the ore stopped working because it needs water. And we don't have water. Because I need 40,000 in order to give control net to this bad boy. Which we should just get in a moment. In about one second. Yeah, there we have it. There you see So we'll stick that in. Well, I don't suppose it matters where, really, does it? Yeah, there we'll do fine. Right, so we'll get this place hired, this control net facility. So I'm kind of hoping this means we won't need to build any more academies in any part of the region again. Right, working. Good, good, good. We're only transmitting 270, though. And we need 1,450. That means we need more high wealth workers. Have we got medium wealth workers in here now? We've got six. Leaving this town for... How is this city even making a profit? Everybody just seems to hate it. Well, at least the uh, Amiga does affect the Mega Towers. I can see that for certainty now. Right, so we've got a nest. Let's slow things down a bit. Let's slow things down. Because things aren't working out too well here, are they? Right, what we desperately need is water. There's no doubt about that. So let's temporarily, until we get this control net working, stick in some more water. We'll put a road down here. Anything will do. Uh, where's the water table? Oh, it's just... <sighs> right, down there. Gotcha. So we'll bring a row down. Light is all we need. We'll stick the water in there. Now we're in excess. Brilliant. Sewage is apparently still posing a problem. Of course it is. Right, I think I... Oh, it's working. Oh, no, it's not. Well, it says it sort of is, but... I don't know how it could be when it's not actually got any control on it. It's saying sewage storage at maximum capacity. I'm guessing that's just a bug. I don't think it's actually working. 
Right, so we'll start purchasing. I oh, know this is annoying. I have got a plan. I just need to uh, implement it gradually rather than all at once. So we're going to start purchasing sewage once, uh, once more. Come on. Right, the sewage problem should actually be sorted now. But apparently it's not. Water's still red. Although we do have an excess. It's only a very small excess. And I am planning to change that. Oh, look at our profits. I don't like the look of that. Hello, here I come, 222. Welcome to the stream. It's good to have you on board. You've just joined us in our Amiga City where things aren't going as well as they were when we first started the stream this evening. Our profits have skyrocketed down from about 9,000 simoleons per hour to a little over 200 simoleons per hour. I guess at least we are making a profit. Why is water? It says we have a 4.8 kilogram excess. I'm going to close this. So that nobody's trying to use it at the minute in any way, shape or form. Right. Those red things have now dispatched. And we're still not collecting enough workers here. Right, these all need to move in. And apparently they are doing so. They need education, do they? Uh, because we've got school in the other region, can we just stick bus stops down here and it will take them to their destination? Maybe. Who knows, but I'm going to stick a few in anyway. I mean, they're getting smiley faces, so I'm kind of hoping that that's the case. Right, okay, things are looking better. Our profit's gone up to 900 simoleons per hour now. So just to clarify, since a few new people have joined the stream, we're going for Sim City Cities of Tomorrow uh, for about another 40, 45 minutes, something uh, along those lines. And then I'll be switching over to Final Fantasy VIII in order to continue on where we uh, left off previously on that. Right, what we really need is to get workers into this control net. If we can get workers in there, then we can generate enough control net to open the sewage sanitizer, which should hopefully sort out all our sewage and water problems. And in turn, that should give us access to more of the good stuff over here. Now, why are we, uh, we running out of raw ore? We should not be running out of ore. Ah, oh, look at this, man. We're making a lot of Amiga. That's awesome. Uh, although we do need ore. Right, how's ore over here? Bad. Ore is bad. That means you need to be generating more ore. Not enough Simonis. What are you talking about? 16,000 and we haven't got enough. Let's speed things up a bit. At least we're getting uh, the profits moving in the right direction now. It's a good start, to be honest. Just hurry up and give them my 16,000. 4,000 per hour. Good, good. So one more hour and we can stick this in. I'll just wait for it. It won't take long. Our oh, Amiga production has slowed down though. There we go. 196 tons. That's not a whole lot, but... Oh, 287 tons over here. That's actually more, isn't it? Even though it doesn't look like it has read the ground. Okay, that's the best place to ram that down. I mean, I guess we could put another one in, couldn't we? Oh, no, we couldn't. We haven't got any money. But look, our money is going up again. Although water issues are returning. People are moving into this area. They're still complaining about education. We could stick an education level on there. Maybe I'll just do that and shut them up. Oh, okay. Are we generating control net now? We're getting there. We're getting there. We're not actually generating any high wealth control net, which we could be doing with. So maybe we could stick some high wealth sims in the area. 
Not a whole lot of them, I will point out, because... Uh, I don't actually want a lot of residential here. But if we stick those down there... And use our parks to stick in some of this good stuff. What? Put that in. And that. Oh, we need some police. I guess we uh, are not collecting enough from uh, the other place. Hmm. We've not actually got a lot of houses down here, have we? So we're going to expand that a little bit more. I know it doesn't look too pretty, but we can sort that out later, I should think. Let's stick some other random bits of good stuff down. Just trying to get this uh, land value to be in this dark blue colour. Because that just means then that the, uh, the richer sims will move in. Which we need, because we need those jobs being fulfilled. I guess we can upgrade the road as well. Maybe we can get some higher density, uh, wealthier sims in, if that makes sense. Look, still having water issues. That's why I'm trying to get this sorted now. I truly am. Let's just go straight for higher density. And here as well. I don't know if that matters, being connected to it or not. Let's go for a nice curvature there. Uh, might as well go for high density as well. Just like that, look. We can connect ourselves to the highway. I know that looks like a weird angle, but when we delete this road here, that weirdness will be gone. What's that black house? Is that just the design? Yeah. Yeah, it is. What are they complaining about, if anything? Build a recycling centre. I can't be bothered to do all that, to be honest. Uh, right, have the high wealth sims started moving into the jobs here? Nope, apparently they haven't. Ah, it's only medium wealth. What's going on? Oh, no, that's high wealth. Right, there's plenty of jobs over here if you want some. Look, oh, we've got one person. Ooh, 1,210 control net. Now, how much does this thing need? 1,450. We're getting there. We're getting there. So, just for those who have joined us, we need to collect uh, enough control net to activate this sewage sanitizer because we're having massive water problems and there's no water in the city. There's barely any water in the region, which means we can't purchase any more than we already are purchasing from our first city. So I'm trying to get this sewage sanitizer to work on our behalf, which will collect the city sewage and at the same time turn it into clean drinking water. At least that's the plan. Now let's check. Right, we still need ore. No, no, no. Local delivery is on. Crude oil import. We're going to have to import the ore. As annoying as that is, I don't know any other way around it because we're just not mining enough to keep up with our Amiga demand. Although in saying that, maybe when we've got water activated throughout the entire city, things will be working a little bit uh, smoother. <sighs> this control net is not rushing itself. Right, how are we doing over here? Are they still mo moaning about education? Is it making a profit yet? No, it's not. Expenses 2,600, income 2,300. Do they want shopping or something? Mm, they do want a little bit of shopping. We might have to put in uh, because we've got 10,000 sims in the local city. And that's our only little bit of commercial here at all. And shopping isn't a bad thing to put in, to be honest, because our control, uh, sorry, our Amiga will boost it up. We'll plonk that more level in. We've only got a bit of small, small amount of commercial demand, 
But after we built this, we'll stick another apartment level in on top, uh, which will hopefully fulfill uh, the demand we take away, if that makes sense. We could really probably do with some more uh, height wealth. What are these tacky houses doing here on the end? Well, I thought we put enough of the good stuff in. Let's have a look. Yeah, that'll do. I know we've got the same two things there, but... Right, we've actually got a lot of high wealth residential demand. So I'm thinking we could stick a mega tower in. That will certainly give us enough workers here then. But the elite mega towers are just so much trouble. I just don't think it's worth it. I really don't. Mayor's house. Do we really want a mayor's house in? I guess we could, couldn't we? I know it's not exactly a, a luxurious place to put it. But it might boost some of the land value there. Just to get those medium wealthers in. Need more shoppers to make a profit. Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. Although we are getting there, look. It is going up a little bit. Commercial demand has gone completely now. At this particular point. 1,410. We are so close to that 1,450 mark that we need it to reach. I need to put in some more uh, light residential up here. Or maybe we could upgrade some of these roads. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, we could actually do that now because they are asking for it. Let's just go straight for high density as well. We haven't got a lot of money. In fact, we haven't got any money. But we will have in just a minute. There we go. People are now upgrading. Which is very nice to see. And how long till some more money, please? There we go. And just along here. Oh, and this curvature as well. <coughs> right, our profits will drop at the moment. I'm expecting that because uh, people will move out while these are changed. But we'll just get that little bit in that we need to finish off around here. Did we do both of those? Yes, we did. We didn't do here, which we could do, I guess. And we need more money again. I'm actually starting to forget exactly what I'm uh, trying to work towards here because... I know we want to get the sewage sanitizer done, don't we? For that we need workers. And we want to get the sewage sanitizer done. That's not the ends, that's the means in order to sort out the water problem we're having here. Right, so let's see what this does to our money. Hopefully good things. Where's all the shopping gone? Oh, it's around here, isn't it? Now, Amiga should boost the profits in these places. Oh, right, I see. So once the building has been built, it takes a little bit of time before Amiga starts increasing the profits. I guess that's to stop exploiting or whatnot. <coughs> I guess it makes sense. Um, right, things are starting to open up now. And we are, in fact, going to open our sewage sanitizer at this point. We should get the control net we need. It's still red there. Sewage storage at maximum capacity. Oh, it's green. And if it's green, we're going to close or stop buying sewage from over here. Uh, where are we? Sewage. No, that's water. Stop. That will save us a fair bit of money. Oh, it's actually filling up quite quickly though. So we might have to stick another one in. The good thing is, it's pumping a heck of a lot of water for us. 
So yeah, let's stick some more of these in. Uh, Twenty. Th Why is it we keep running out of bloody money? We had so much money in this city not long ago. Right, we'll wait for 20,000 because I don't want to run out of sewage capacity. <laughs> Although our profits are going back up again. Right, I do want to build a trade headquarters. Not a trade headquarters, an Amiga headquarters. Uh, how do I do that? I'm not going to do it just yet so I know how to do it when I want to do it. There. We can build it now. We couldn't before, but now we can. That will give us access to all the upgrades over here. Control net still okay? Whew, just about. Just about. I oh, know that's the uh, sewage sanitizer. Yeah, control net's fine. Right, that's good. <sighs> well, our money's gone up. Look, activating this has just boosted everything. Ooh, we're running out of stuff there. Do we have stuff here? Nope, not a lot. I'm guessing that's because we're running out of money to buy the stuff with. Uh, right, let's stick another one on now. We can. As soon as that's activated, which will take a moment. Yep, that'll basically double our... Uh, oh, no, we're going to need more control on it now, aren't we? I don't know how much we've got. We've got 1,570. Control net connected, 2,700. Hmm. That's not good. We've not got enough control net to handle all that. Right, we've got to get some high wealth in. We just don't have a choice about that. As annoying as it is, we've got to hit over 10k profits over the first time. Uh, I'm going to send some money across. Oh, Sonny, well, that's not very nice, is it? And we're going to build an elite mega tower. I don't particularly want to build an elite mega tower. I hate working with elite mega towers. But I don't see any other option uh, as to how we're going to get a lot of high wealth workers into the city. Which we're going to need, in all honesty. In order to get that control net signal up. We haven't actually got a lot of money over here, to be fair, have we? Right, we'll take a bond out. We're going to take a bond out in our other city, but it wouldn't be enough. Uh, I hope that the second city is going to appreciate this. Go to region view. <laughs> oh, they need everything, don't they? Everything. Needs health service now. Uh, right, gifting. Money. Got an 140k. Wipe me out. Uh, right. Can we gift health? We're already gifting two ambulances. Maybe we should build a hospital over in the uh, second city. Yeah, I might do that. People are dying, then we're not going to make any money, unfortunately. That's the way the game works. But it's logical. Mm. Got a lot of sims. Uh, right, abandoned building. Bugger off there. Let's just see how... Oh, another one somewhere. <coughs> there. Let's just see how our power's doing now that we've... Uh, ah, we've got plenty of excess there. Plenty. Right, so what was I doing? Oh, uh, yeah. Waiting for some money to come through, aren't we? So let's speed this up a bit. And how much is the Elite Mega Tower against? Like 224,000 or something. Stupid, isn't it? Uh, yes. Yes, it is. And it comes with a bloody medium wealth as well, which we can't get rid of. So we'll just wait for this money to come through. Although, to be fair, it wouldn't have taken that long to save up for with these amounts of profits that we're getting. Got to get these high wealth workers in pretty quickly. So we can expand this. That's not abandoned now, is it? <laughs> yeah, apparently it is. We are running out of crude oil. I've got a feeling that's something to do with the fact that we had no money to purchase it, purchase it off the global market. But now we've certainly uh, got money coming in. 
I keep seeing my money jump down every now and then, and I think that's when we're purchasing the uh, resources. Because it doesn't have, even though that's on like 12k or 13k, you see it's just jumped down again. It can only be the resources don't go into this number here, which is a bit frustrating. I've got to be uh, totally frank with you. Um, right now, where's the money we gifted across? Surely we should have that by now. Why haven't we? Monthly profit and transactions. Two hundred and two thousand. Well, we're getting quite a bit of money in, which is nice now, but... I don't want to take the bond out until we need to, because it's going to eat into our profits a tad. Ah, look, all the stuff is upgrading now. Which is good to see. Good to see. Oh, a bit of traffic there. Do we need to upgrade this road? Nope, it's already upgraded. This one isn't there. I don't know if it even needs to be, but may as well before we forget to do it later. <coughs> what the heck has happened to that money we sent across? And why is this uh, oil power plant not getting enough crude oil? Okay, we'll stick that on, but we're already buying it for over here, so can't they just collect it? Hmm, they are. They've uh, wiped it out. Crude oil. We're importing. Yeah, it's all good. I did not see that money coming, I've got to be honest. Did we just lose it? I hope not. Anyway, for those of you who watch me on the live stream, thank you so much for joining me. Please don't forget to hit the follow button on my Twitch account. And also go and check out my YouTube account. There's lots of SimCity content as well as loads of other cool content from other games over there. So if you like that, go ahead and subscribe as well. We are making a nice profit now. I don't know exactly what I've done, but it seems to have worked whatever it was. The reason this has an increased capacity is because we do not have 2700 control net. The reason we are not currently transmitting all the control net we could be is because of the fact that we have low wealth, uh, sorry, low high wealth worker staff uh, in. Uh, comes in gradually, LDN me off says. Uh, what comes in gradually, sorry. There's a little bit of a delay, actually, when I speak to what comes up on the live stream, so I forgot what I was saying. But if you want to clarify, I'll certainly appreciate that. Uh, if we took out a load now, we're still going to be on 184,000. Fourteen thousand smodings per hour. Love it. That's because this is operating at good capacity now. Good capacity. It's using a lot of oil and a lot of ore. But we can live with that, I think. Now, what is this sort of jerky bit? Oh, it's because we had a road coming down here earlier, isn't it? Right, we'll bring a pretty road off here. Oh, I don't want to delete that. Ah, we'll sort that out later. I know there's a bit of traffic there. It's probably not going to be good for our delivery drivers, but hey, they'll manage. They'll manage. The only issue I can see, though, is that once we build our high wealth tower, they're going to be stressed by the lack of... Hang on, have we got police? We have, but we've got full jail cells and only two police cars. We need to sort that out pretty pronto. Uh, jail cells, ground floor, yep. Oh, uh, why haven't we got a sign in? And we can't even put a flag in. Well, that's looking better anyway. Eight crimes committed per day. Some criminals here. Come and sort it out, please. It's supposed to be my police force. And I want a police force I can be proud of. Ah. <sighs> We 
We've got fire in the region, haven't we? Ready to respond to fires. What's that? Uh, crime in progress. What road's this? Uh, that's uh, definitely high density. I remember upgrading it. Uh, right. Let's take some money out. What's that? Hazmat fires. We need a fire station to take care of them. And I don't want to put one of those in at the minute. So let's take our bond out. Whew, expensive I know and goodness knows what this is going to do to our sewage and uh, other outputs. Let's just first of all make sure that we're definitely getting a uh, high wealth thingy majig. Put another one in. Don't want to be too routine. There we go. Now we can stick our tower in. I don't think they're going to be too pleased about this, but we'll find out sooner rather than later. Mm, really need this on a straight bit of road, don't we? Oh, it's already connected it for us. That's awesome. Right, what else needs connecting here? We've still got some money coming in. Nice to see. You go there, and there's usually three connections here. So, yeah, there's the other one. That scared the sh... Well, it made me jump. Where is it? Ah, at least it wasn't our uh, Amiga factory. Wouldn't I like that, to be honest? Right, is this built yet? We need to get high wealth sims in, you see. Wow, that hit into our profits, didn't it? All done, good, good. High wealth apartment level. The problem here is if these aren't happy, then it completely and utterly bugs out and they can never be happy. Which, trust me, is not good. I don't know if it's going to make any difference, but we'll stick some bus stops in anyway. Uh, do we really want to stick a university into this region? In our Amiga region, do we really want to do that? But apart from the fact we couldn't afford to yet anyway. But I'm just concerned about the folks up here. Well, they're okay. We're at maximum capacity. Garbage is going to make us sick. That's not good. If we can get those workers over here. Right, garbage capacity. Are we even using our own waste disposal or not? Uh, recycling centre, no thank you. Yeah, go on then, we'll put that over here. Some more garbage trucks in if we can afford them. We can, as it turns out. They're only 100 per hour as well, so no excuse not to do that. Now, this is going to fill up quickly with all those garbage trucks. If we can get this hired, whoa, well, speed up a bit, will you? Then I might just stick some incinerators in straight from the off. That city's been rebuilt that we lost originally. Does this use Amiga? Yeah, it does. They want parkour more levels than we... Well, I was going to say we'd best get one in, but they seem happy enough now as they are. I guess we could put one in. Put one in for a bit of fun. Uh, yeah, high wealth. Oh, not enough simoleons. Okay, scrap that idea. Are they working here yet? Not yet. We need to put some... Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Research gar uh, garbage atomizer. But well, we haven't got that yet, so. How much are these? 25,000 smellions. Are you joking me? Will you stop slowing down? We'll get that in just a minute. There we go. I'm not sure if one will be enough, but it should hopefully delay the amount of uh, garbage that's going there. I guess we could start purchasing garbage now over in our other city. We'll do that in a minute. All these germs are bad for our health. Well, it's okay because we've sorted that out now, haven't we? And I was thinking about putting in a university. You know what? I'm going to do so. I am going to do so. We could use one anyhow. So we're going to stick a high density street across there because that is where our university will be going. I'm going to need to sort these traffic problems out. I'm going to just pause the game momentarily. I apologise to all these cars in advance. Ah, whatever. We don't need that. It's only 400 simoleon. A uh, piece of gear. And we'll just go for a straight off high density street down there. Just like that. Those dirt paths are all only temporary anyway. Is that abandoned? No, it's just looking uh, like it was. Thinking here for our university, that should keep our height wealth sims on the happy side of life hmm maybe we could go for an avenue here because that is like a central point of uh, whatever you call it commerce maybe there we go I don't use avenues an awful lot in this game but sometimes they do tend to help I mean, I guess we could use one across here as well, just to help with the traffic, because it's pointless having an avenue if they can't actually get in or out of the city this way. Go on then, I've been persuaded. I don't think you can upgrade uh, to an avenue, you do have to rebuild from scratch. Just like that. And on pause. And let's see if the traffic builds up again. Uh, no, it's awesome. The only t place we're getting traffic now is going back onto this non avenue, but I can't do anything about that. I don't know, we've got a little bit there, but it's got to be better. It's got to be better. Right. I wanted to do university, but I can't because I haven't got any money. Control it. Ha! 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 Control net is solved for now until they start complaining about something. The high wealth sims have moved in and are getting their asses to work. That's what I like to see. We possibly need to stick another one in. I do need to be careful because it uses a lot of control net. Look, we're using 4K now. But we are processing 36 k gal, 40 k gal of sewage, and pumping out 40 k gal of water. Whew. We don't want that to come down in any way, shape, or form, though. Right, so let me just check how we are on water. We've got a 9 k gal excess. We need 55 k gal. We're currently pumping 54. Four. So things are a bit close there, but the more sewage we produce, then the more water we shall pump. Garbage. Ah, oh, it's because we're still buying it, isn't it? Let's fix that. Uh, no region view, sorry. Garbage. Oh, it's being gifted. Oh, it's being gifted, we're not paying for it, are we? I don't suppose we need to worry about it then. Right, that's sorted. 
does that now mean we can actually stick in the thing I wanted to stick in? The Amiga headquarters. I would say, yes, we can. We'll put that there. Uh, let's move it up a little bit in case we want to expand the trade depot later. Hopefully that won't make the Sims 2 unhappy. Ah, right, and we can upgrade it, as you would expect. Congratulations, what? Oh, I don't want to name my city. If I want to name my city, it would already be named. Uh, okay, let's hire. And we can actually see all our profits and whatnot from here. Which is nice to see. Can we get this thing open, please? Oh, it is open. <laughs> what can we add on to this joint? Uh, every upgrade we can add something else on. Commerce division. Let's start from the beginning. Robotics division. Oh, I've got an itchy nose, sorry. We can create drones. Okay. That will basically give us futurized police forces, fire forces, and stuff of that nature. We could put in a, an, a, put in an extraction division, uh, which gives us access to augmented coal and ore shafts and oil wells and that gives it to uh, the region as well not just the city and also commerce division global market VTOL pads heavy lift VTOL pads raw ore crude oil and other stuff and regional trading for Omega okay What is it we can add to this thing there? Uh, nothing until we get... Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Nothing until we start adding divisions in. Uh, what does this do? The global market veto pad. Receives global market resource deliveries by VTOL aircraft. Hmm. Okay. So it's to do with the trading, but without having to use traditional trade depots. Well, I think our Amiga factory is going pretty smoothly at the minute anyway. Despite the fact that we are, at times, struggling a little bit with our funded situation. But we can uh, always find a way out of that. Oh, no, 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 no. Right, we need to get a... Right, we need to get a university in, and a hospital. That is the priority. If we don't get a university in, then these will uh, not be coming back in any way, shape, or form, which is not good. So, oh, I'm getting confused. Education. University. 88,000. Right, next hour we can build this. And believe me, I will be doing so. Got it. Right, we got it. We should have had a university by now in the region anyway, to be honest, so I'm not too concerned about having this in the same city as our uh, Omega. Right, these hopefully won't moan too much about education now. Right, hospital, that's what we need next, but how much is a pretty awesome hospital going to cost us? 120,000, wow. That's not cheap. It's got to be said, that is not cheap. How long does it take to get staff in this university? Too long. Schools don't have enough teachers. What are you talking about? You've got all these staff over here. And everybody over here as well, and you're telling me there's not enough. Well, at least we're making some nice uh, money over here. Not a lot, but some. Alright, that's more like it. Yes, let's start a research project. Go away. 
if you're not going to give us something that we can make then I'm not interested your kids might need education but they can have it now because there's a nice university here and it's not actually in opening hours so you just have to wait till the morning then your kids can get education anyway folks I'm going to leave the city for today just once I've deleted some of these buildings uh, we'll pick up our live stream next week but that's not the end for me uh, from me for tonight because I'm going to soon be starting a live stream for Final Fantasy 8 and we'll do an hour of that before I head back home to go to bed so once again thanks a lot for joining me tonight and yeah we'll play more SimCity again soon right so I am going to have to end the live stream uh, while I set the next game up but I will be coming back on in a few minutes with that alright folks take care